This is Michael Moss in Killeen, Texas. During weekly prayers, the Islamic community of Greater Killeen near Fort Hood was stunned by the killings on Thursday. I just felt embarrassed and angry at the same time because I feel, you know, people, most people stereotype Muslims from a, uh, just by, oh look, there's another Muslim on television. You know, they, I just don't want them to bring, make it hateful for all other Muslims for other people to hate Muslims because of what actions he may have committed. Army Major Nidal Malik Hassan began attending prayers here about two months ago. Uh, first of all, I would request all of you to please uh, observe a moment of silence and uh, pray for them. Uh, may God bless them who lost their life, innocent life, you know, in this horrible act. So please observe a few minute moments of silence. The day before the killing spree, Victor Benjamin and Dwayne Reasoner say they spoke with Major Hassan. I saw Brother Nadal Wednesday night after prayer. His usual self, calm, caring, he listened. He wasn't fidgeting, he wasn't anxious about anything. He was, I, when I heard the news, it, it was a complete surprise. But we had went out, we had gone out to eat. It was just a regular night. There wasn't really any problems, he acted normally. We had been um, going to dinner for, you know, on several occasions. Um, I didn't see any problem with him, he was nice. He went to every single prayer at the mosque, uh, there was really no problems. I didn't believe it. Uh, at first, I only heard the name and the, the sequence of events. And then uh, I saw his picture, which didn't quite look like him in person, and um, put two and two together. You know, I didn't want to believe it. Um, I was surprised. Really, I was surprised I didn't know that uh, that's what he was planning. He seemed fine the day before. Why? Same question I think anyone would ask is why? What happened? He mentioned to me that, that he prays for, for guidance from Allah uh, on a daily basis. I mean, that's what any Muslim does. And he said that uh, he was praying to, to, uh, to either be engaged or to find the, uh, the right woman for him. That's, that's what he said, he was looking to get married. He had told me that he was going to be deployed to Afghanistan next month, and he was um, upset about it, obviously. There's a conflict of interest when a Muslim goes and fights against Muslims and will uh, have a chance of killing them. It reminded me of 9-11 uh, and uh, it just seemed like, like somebody had been really hurt man was retaliating. 